Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Unboxing and coffee making time. So, as I mentioned in my previous video, I bought a coffee maker. This thing actually came in on Sunday, but I was waiting for the coffee beans that I ordered through a subscription service, which only came in today. And that's Wednesday, so I'm filming this on Wednesday. Can't wait to try these two out together. So, got my pen knife. You know what? Let me just rip this bag. This has a thing, anyways. Uh, okay, yeah. So, here I got a Wakako Nano Presso, which I ordered in the What's it called again? I can't remember But it's a limited edition one So it comes with this kind of design A winter design So let's go ahead and open it up Okay So this is the coffee maker In the case Yes, okay and comes with a sticker and another sticker okay now to open this so this one comes with a case the um, standard one doesn't come with a case but if you get it in the limited edition it comes with a case so here you go look at that design can you see it? Yeah, so go wintry design. So I'm gonna try to figure out how to use this. Hmm. I think I'm doing it wrong. So, oh, okay. It was slightly unsettling. Mm hmm. And then this is for the water containment, if I'm not wrong. Yeah. Okay, so... Got like a little measuring kind of cup and then a little brush. And the filter for you to put your coffee beans, coffee grounds into. Like, you scoop it and like, yeah. And yeah, this is the place where it all comes out of. And I'm gonna go wash this before I use it. It's actually heavier than I thought it would be. Like this part especially. It's like where all the mechanism is. Yeah, so... It's easy to keep though, so that's good. And... Okay, let's unbox the coffee grounds. Mm. Yeah, I'll just tear it as well. Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll just use this. It's sticky. Oh, I swear to god, it keeps flipping itself. Why? Okay, I'll stay here. It kept... Like, flipping itself. Okay, okay, I don't need this anymore. Okay, so I actually ordered a... Hmm, smells really strong. I ordered it in two packs. So, Altura and Urbanite. I swear to god, this 
focus is terrible. Okay, Altura and Urbanite. So I get more to try. And so Urbanite and Altura. Okay. I tried to use a better a better camera just so that the quality won't be as shitty as it was. Alright, so I'm back. I cleaned this with hot water. And I also brought hot water for the coffee. So I actually rinsed this through twice. So I I would fill up this part with hot water, like as if I were making the coffee and then pump it out. But the thing is that it still smelled like rubber. Yeah, I don't know what to do about that, but I've cleaned it to the best that I can. Uh, hope I don't die. Yeah. So, let's start with the Urbanite, I guess. Since this was the one that I picked up. And, okay, let's open this up. Oh, wow. Well, this is... Okay, so Urbanite That was a close one, I almost got all the coffee on the floor Okay, so As the instruction says It says 8 grams Hmm you know what, I'll just do it by one scoop, I guess. Let's see how that goes. One scoop of this delicious smelling coffee. Uh, hope I don't drop this. So. Okay. And then do this. Okay, this is actually s still slightly wet, so I hope that does not affect it too much. And go. Oh, okay, I've got a bit of coffee on the table. And temp it. Oh, this is too much coffee. I'm pretty sure this is too much. Is this really full? I'm, I'm scared. Oof. Okay. Time hard. Okay. And let's just put it um put it here. Okay. And I'll stuff it here. So there's like this little thing and this little kind of wedge at the bottom. So it fits nicely. And then I'll close it. Okay, now time for the water. So the water, I actually used a measuring jug. So I got like 150. It's kind of warm now though, the water. It's not as hot as it was. So 150 and roughly divided into two. So I have two cups of hot water. So it's actually, uh, how do I show this? 
it's slightly below the line. And let's put it in here. Is that supposed to happen? I am not sure what's going on, but there's the sound. Okay, okay. Wait, was this supposed to be locked? Yeah, it was supposed to be locked, but alright, alright. Let's try. Um. Okay, let me lock it and unlock and pump eight times. <laughs> The glass was actually up to around here, but the coffee that comes out is not a full cup. I mean, um, not the same level as it was. So this is the other cup, and it's on this different level. Okay. Cool, cool. Okay, so. Let me try the Altura. Altura. I am blocking my viewfinder. So, let's go open the back. So, the Altura is from Colombia. The. What's it called? Urbanites from Brazil, Colombia, Alturas from Colombia, and has hints of pomegranate, red grape, and honey. So kind of similar to the Urbanite, just that it doesn't have the chocolate, caramel, hazelnut taste, I guess. Yeah, okay, so... Okay, let's go get some grounds hmm it actually smells similar to the urbanite maybe I won't get as much grounds as I did before so I got like this there's a lot of fibers or something like husk I don't know if that's how it's supposed to be but okay so for the urbanite I actually filled it filled the scoop like pretty much the top so for this look, it's not as full okay it's easier to temper It's dripping coffee. Yep. So another glass. Let's do this. Palms, let's go. Okay, so 
This one has a Tina crema. Look at it. It's thinner. It's not as dark. For some reason. Not too sure. Maybe it's the roast. Okay, so this is a medium roast. And this is a medium duck. Okay, that explains why. Yep, yep, I was right. It's the roast. So, medium duck and medium. There's like a clear difference. Let me just clean up this mess first. Time to. Did I just mess up? Which is which? I'm assuming the lighter one is supposed to be the medium, medium roast and the medium dark. Yes. So let's try the urbanite. Well. It's cold now. It's quite sour, a little bitter, in Altura. Oh, this is much, much more sour. I think I extracted either of it right because it's hmm it doesn't really taste like espresso. It's not smooth and thick. It's just really watery and okay, there's a crema but it doesn't taste like an espresso. I'm thinking that it's probably just me because I've seen like videos where you know they have like the perfect it looks good but I don't know I think it's just me oh well I'll try more and if it's if it turns out good then I'll put it into my channel What's it called? The timeline thing, you know? So, as of today, this is what I have. And... Okay, I'm sorry. If I look like I'm looking that way, it's because the viewfinder is that way. Yeah, so, as of today, it's kind of a fail. I will have to keep using it because I spent a hundred and sixty dollars on this. Yeah, so I need to make it worthwhile. And then there's the coffee. I I'll see whether I'll stop the subscription. Maybe uh, maybe I'll let it continue. And yeah, maybe in the future when I master this, I'll show you guys again. But for now, that's it. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, follow me in my socials down below. Like in the description box. Yeah. And thanks. Toodles. Unboxing and coffee making time. Taste, not taste, smells great.